guys welcome to my youtube channel today we're going to be reviewing the time tech premium memory i actually got this from amazon and um, due to the reason um, my imac um, came actually with eight gig memory of ram size and i needed something bigger to enable me get a faster and a smooth um, editing um, process in doing my video so here is it let's open it up So one of the things you should know is that uh, this memory size uh, actually is a 16 gig with a 2 RAM and um, it's ex actually got an exclusive discount and um, here you have the 8 gig DDR4 2400 and that's uh, double so it's brand new I actually got it from Amazon and uh, we're gonna do a quick review for it as I said previously and uh, here as you can see we have the, the two RAM and um, we're gonna get started first by uh, what I already have on my computer so let's get started right here now my iMac is shut down so I have to turn it up so you see exactly what I'm talking about so I got this iMac from um, Apple Store it's uh, actually the 2017 Core i5 and um, it came with uh, 8 gig memory size and uh, it's really pretty very slow for editing videos especially using Premiere so I needed to upgrade it and um, as you can see on screen it's um, iMac Retina 5K 27 inches 2017 processor is 3.5 gigahertz uh, the intercore i5 just as you can see it's uh, pretty um, effective for daily use like web browsing and maybe photo editing and uh, creating other graphics but when I tried using it to do videos and uh, edit videos it's pretty small so you see it came with a 4 gig and the 4 which is the make up to 8 gig so let's get started I'm gonna show you how you're gonna um, install the RAM just in case you have to buy one of them and I pretty recommend the time tech because it's uh, something I did a review on, on online and uh, it's pretty good it's pretty fast and uh, we got 16 gig already so 16 plus uh, 8 which I already have is gonna give us 24 so first you need to get a screwdriver which you need to use to open up the, the casing where you have the RAMs and I'm um, just gonna show you quickly that's the case so we're gonna open up the RAM casing where you have all the RAMs so like I said before I have a 4 gig by 4 gig which is a 8 gig RAM and I already bought the time tech which is gonna make up 16 gig for both 8 gig RAMs individually and um, just gonna put it in like that that's the second one I'm gonna put the second one on the top layer uh, actually, uh, the iMacs usually come with four com uh, compartments where you have one, two, three, four there. And uh, the, the bottom two is the four gig by four gig, which make up eight gig. And the top two is the new, which I just installed. And that's gonna make up uh, 16 plus the previous eight gig I have on the iMac. And uh, let's close it up. We need to push tight so the locking pretty good put the compartment back the casing close it properly and uh, we get the power switch the power switch is right there so you put it neatly through the hole on the on the stand and lock it in that's it pretty simple easy and something you can do yourself at home so now we're gonna power on the iMac 
So we'll see how fast it's gonna go. Pretty fast. It looks smooth and um, right here we have my channel it's it's pretty <laughs> it's pretty still empty with videos and all that so here yeah, you have now uh, we can see now that the memory is upgraded up to 24 gigabytes and uh, it's 2400 megahertz DDR4 cool so that's it and um, I'm going to try up some apps and see how fast it's going to go on Photoshop. Pretty fast, that's good. So I guess with the two RAMs I just installed which makes up a 24 gig memory RAM I have right now, it's pretty going to make the whole video editing thing smooth and perfect. So that's it. Thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and uh, also leave your comment behind.